Cody, congrats on the new deal. How happy are you to have signed? Yeah, I'm, I'm happy. I mean, for me, it was a no-brainer to, to be back where I feel I belong. I think it's a club that I've, I've worked hard at and, and I've worked hard over the last few years with the gaffer, you know, trying to improve my game and there's more room for improvement. Obviously, with the new deal, you're going into your fourth and your fifth season. Obviously, it's something that you want to you want to become a regular place. You want it to become your home. And do you get that sort of impression when you come here in Oldershot Town? Hundred percent. I think I, I, I reiterated before when I first came to the club. My first thing, I had a real kind of connection with the club, and and for me, that's it's still going on, and, and I look forward to the future. And the the security of a two year deal must be good for you, and hopefully strive on get even better next year and the year after that. Yeah, hundred percent. I'm I'm grateful and thankful to the gaffer for the contract, and and I'm looking forward to it. A lot of people would say last season was your best season so far for the club. How do you reflect on last season, both personally as a team? Um, I think personally, I'm, I'm happy with it, um, but it, it's done now. I mean, I mean, we're going into the new season now, so it's about looking forward. As a team, we done okay. I mean, we started okay. We got into like our, our stride midway through, and then we flaked off a bit. But we're looking to improve the next season. Of course, I've read an interview from me recently that you obviously want to prove defensively, but also going forward as well, you want to you know score more goals, provide more of an influence going forward as well. Yeah, I think that's something I can add to my game. Is something I'm capable of. I mean, I've scored two goals in three games, so that's something I'm, I'm able to do. Obviously, the natural progression is as you stay at a place you want to keep on proving year on year. Is the natural progression now for next season, the year after that, to get even better and even better again? Hundred percent. I think every year you want to be better than. And he was last, and this season was starting as a clean sheet, a uh, clean slate. Sorry, and and for me, it's just about proving myself again. I think as you've you know, as you've grown in the year and you've grown in the role that you have at the football club, I'd say that you know I'm sure you back me up here that you've turned into more of a leader in the football club. You know, you talk more to your players, you're more commanding of what you want and the expectations you expect. Do you feel that as well? Do you think that's an influence you have on the team? Hundred percent. I think it's something that I've I've worked on. Um, I've kind of paid a bit more attention to it last season. And, becoming a, a leader in the team it is what I want to be. Because obviously we spoke about the manager as well, obviously he's only brought you in as well and he's developed you and worked with you for a long time. Do you feel like the influence of him staying for another two years has helped you in your decision to stay as well? Yeah, of course. I think for the gaffer to be here for the next two years and, and to kind of give me a two-year deal to, to, to stay with him, I mean, it just makes me want to go out and, and prove to him that, that I'm thankful and things like that, really. And just finally, what are your goals and targets for next season personally and as a team? Um, personally, is to keep as many clean sheets as possible. I um, want to improve on last year. We were okay. We could see from less set pieces. And as a team, we want to we want to be better than we was last year. We want to finish higher up in the table. It's as simple as that. And we want to be competing. Are you in the shop? Sign up below. Subscribe. Click here for the next video and click here to subscribe. Ah.